Hello and welcome to what the fuck happened with that? Welcome to our anthem review discussion video. We are Rabbit Hole Media. I am Christian Rasham. This is Jack Netley Thompson. Hello, Jack. How are you this evening? I'm all right. Yeah, you well? Yeah, you well? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I'm all right. Looking, looking forward to playing and discussing some anthem. I guess we'll, we'll find out. We have things to say. We do have things to say. Lots to talk about. Lots to discuss. Lots to play. But first. This is Rabbit Hole Media. Don't forget you can follow us on Twitter at rabbithole underscore UK. You can subscribe to us on YouTube where you can see us anytime you wish. You can follow us on Twitch at Rabbit Hole Media. And you can subscribe and follow us on multiple different podcast services on and around the internet. Do you know what's mad confusing? What? The delay. I'm not looking at it. Yeah. I'm not looking at it at all. Mm. Say indeed. 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 This is live on Twitch where we'll be playing and discussing Anthem for the next hour, hour and a half or so. Mm-hmm. Feel free to join in in the comments, tell us what you think, have a laugh with us, have a chat with us, and enjoy all of those things. In the meantime, Jack. Unless you disagree, in which case we don't care. Should we play some Anthem? I'm kidding. Let's play Anthem. Right, Jack, I think... Wait, I'm fucking miles away from what I was doing. Let's start a conversation and I can start doing things. Okay. Here's my first question for you. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Well, it's not really a question. I, I not enjoyed Anthem very much. Yeah been public about that yep you would have seen that on this week's episode of press start yep 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 i want you to tell me why i'm wrong do you know okay that's not what's not gone well <laughs> um i enjoy it but that doesn't mean shit really uh, uh for example jack why says can I not... shit game why can i not you spell, how do you spell yeet wrong? Oh, he's put, uh, he's put heat. Heat. Also, it's not a shit game. Don't be one of those people. <laughs> Don't be one of those fucking people. Uh, who's, who's this oh, bitch? Oh, shit, I made an error. What have you done? I didn't start recording. Oh. It's fine. You carry on. I'll, I'll start recording now, and I'll work around it. Hello there. I'll hmm? grab the bit Sorry. from Twitch, and I'll... Uh, yeah, if it's not shit. I'm right. It'll be fine. <laughs> It'll be fine. Oh, we'll be fine. <laughs> We're new to this. What a shit storm it is here. The entire point was to record. I know, I forgot to press the button. <laughs> yeah, you did. Uh, <laughs> no, we haven't had to do that before. <laughs> it's fine. Um, I don't know why I started this conversation. Okay, this is so not here is one of my first issues of this game. These conversations are, in my opinion, mostly dull and uninteresting. There's this weird oh, option choose a dialogue thing, which I can't really see what impact it has. Things off like screen and then do tell they? you different stories they? based on do they prove it My sister says hi hannah long. prove it she left this is going to take a really long time if you want me to prove it I'm gonna I, I just this person's like going to go and have to do shit. that's why i regret doing oh goodbye this is, and this is how I've this how this is how I've been playing that game. Uh, skip, finish. See, Let I me get to the flying shooty bit. Yeah, okay. But that is vivid. That'll be why you. Uh, <laughs> yeah, my javelins. <laughs> my javelins are quite um, fucking luminescent. <laughs> quite bright. Uh, so this is my ranger. I want to be seen in the dark. There is no such thing as stealth when you are wearing something of this color. Yeah, there's. Uh, I did not make that blue. Blue is just a thing that okay. won't go away. Okay, I like um, the white palms. The white palms, yeah. See, I spent hours on my javelins, and they still look like they were done by a <laughs> fucking child. But what I'll do... Oh, cunt it. <laughs> what I'll do... Right, there we go. And here we go, with the first four-hour load screen. The first loading screen. Hi, Hannah, I didn't say hi. Um, for... F oh, oh! Oh, my shit God! <laughs> Shit the bed, right? I'm going to show you all my vibrant javelins. Oh, that's that's <laughs> tell me more. <laughs> that's a sentence. So this is my. This is your hunter. This is my, um, this is my glosses, which I call Gettys. Okay, you'll see why in a minute. Get ya, I get ya. He's very bright. He's very, uh, very Tim. Yeah, very Tim. I like that actually. Yeah, so I. I like that. So I the the black trim, and this is the one that used to load used to look like <laughs> that's so fucking vivid i don't like the green and orange one i'm sorry it's disgusting oh now that's nice tom would love that tom would cream because that is witzman colors yeah but he does them the wrong way around well they're his colors he can do whatever the fuck he wants see the bit that i didn't do either i swear on my life it's just added pink pink i don't How like the pink 
Well, have a look. Show me. Let's have a look. See if there's pink as an option in your um, do bar. Do 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 do. So, so we may as well talk about the customization while we're here. What? That is fucking great. Pink. See, you've got it there. Oh, I did that by accident. Entirely by accident. Here, yeah, there you go. Yeah, that's nice. So, yes, it's great to a degree. Like, so. The amount you can go into details, change the materials and stuff like that is great. But shit like this. Oh, the lack of actual... The lack of actual options. Yeah, yeah, I have yeah, yeah. one. And it's <laughs> rubbish. Yep. And also so expensive. 14,000... Suck my dick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. But, it needs more, like, plating options. Yeah. It like, needs the more colours and designs and stuff, like stuff is really good. But, but. You, well, the fact that you can go into this and... Um, which one's his face? Oh, that's another thing. You can't change the colour of his face. So if I wanted to change material, in my view, if I zoom in and go up to his... To make it all different. Mm -hmm. Materials and... Ooh. Nice. It's weird. Make all different materials or what have you. You can just make it pure metal if you wanted to... to which I've decided I'm going to do. <laughs> um, all sorts of shit. You can change all the... F fabrics and the colours. Why has it gone black? Have you changed the material? Like? Yeah, I think... I. Oh, yeah, it's because it's that one and you pick two colours, so yeah. I must have picked the primary as black. I'm actually not against that. <laughs> That's quite nice. Oh, sorry. What did I make the other metal? Blend it with the other metal, that one. I like that, yep. But yeah, the customization is actually. That's one stylish. Which one, Hannah? Which suit? Because I have many that are very. I think that comment popped up when it was the uh, red and orange one, I think. Green and orange? That's what I said. You said red and orange. No, I said green. Green and orange. Yes, the customization <laughs> is really good. You can go in and do all Yeah, these, I think it's really good. I think it's really do good. Do all these different stuff. I'm going to be my. I'm going to start off in my incredibly, incredibly violent. See, it's red and orange. Vibrant. Not violent. It's violent too. What? I changed it, you fuck! You. This is what. This is one of the things where it takes fucking forever to do anything. There you go. There you go. What? <laughs> this is gone. Right, let's See try. you, sir. Let's try this again, shall we? It's ticked on Ranger. It's just fucking bugged out. I reckon when you come out, it'll be on the one you want. But all my perks are on. We'll find out. We're going to play as whatever one it it puts me in. <coughs> oh, stuck in my throat. Stuck in my throat. Molly card one you walked up to, yes. Yeah, so oh, yeah, the, the, um, the, the green and orange. The one. incredibly, incredibly vibrant one. So, okay. So, and this is one of my biggest issues. You, you can have a few missions on at a time. But you can't just stay in the world. I'll show you what we mean, but obviously I have two missions that are active. Yeah. One's just a random mission and one is a story one. Okay. So you go to the, you track the mission. Uh, you get absolutely fuck all loot if you don't play on hard. So start expedition, it's going to start matchmaking, what have you. But you go and do the mission and then you load back out. Yeah, it takes you back to the fort every time. It takes you back yeah. out, and it's just... It breaks the pacing up. It completely breaks the pacing up. Is this going to do the entire thing? You can see my baby face. <laughs> but yeah. Like, I really enjoy this game, and when you start playing it, and you're in the world, and you're actually playing it, I really fucking enjoy this game. It's yeah, just so, the it's so broken up. And so the actual gameplay when you get into playing, I also really enjoy. The flying feels great. Yep. Um, you can do some really cool shit as mm -hmm. well. Uh, I think the shooting mechanics are really, really good too. Uh, I like all the different sort of supers and things you have. I do. My one issue with the shooting mechanics is I feel like my higher powered guns I have unlocked are no different to the ones I had in the first place. I don't feel like I'm getting a different effect from my yeah, guns. Yeah, that's one of the things a lot of people have been talking about is in terms of weaponry and stuff you got, it's all throwaway until you get to the end game. Yeah. Um, uh, it's all just shooting things. The game isn't, like, the combat isn't challenging either. And by the way, I do say it's not a shooter. 
Yeah, I know. I know. Yeah, it's mainly about your powers and the combos and stuff like that. But yeah. again, um, guns are still important in the game, and yeah. they should be. They should feel better. Another thing about the customization actually is that obviously you can change all your moves and everything, but your ultimate is that. That is your ultimate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And there's no different ultimates and stuff like that, and it gets really boring. Loading. Yeah, this was the colossal loading yeah. we're talking about. <laughs> My God, there we go. Chelsea oh, going. God, I look at it. It's so vivid. <laughs> I know, I fucking love it. I love it so much. Okay, so, and also it takes... For, there we go. We're assuming Diggs will make a play for that. Like, oh. Yeah, it feels great. It feels so Iron Man. Like shit like that is so cool. That's one of my favorite things to do, especially in the middle of combat. It's just flying at you to do that. Oh! I don't like that you can't fly like this and shoot. When you start shooting, it goes you straight up into that mode. This. Yeah. You can't. I'd like to be able to fly like that and be shooting and doing my rockets and stuff as full on Iron Man actually. And you overheat too quickly. I overheat oh, I so quickly. Um, are they even... Are they fucking coming? Fuck them. Right, okay. This will be interesting. Well, it looks like we're about to get into some, com some combat. So my favourite way to start a fight. Yeah, I do, I do. And obviously... There's nothing groundbreaking. In terms of combat and stuff, but it is a lot of fun. If I can fucking do this. Yeah, right. in the same way that Destiny is. Yeah. That's not a negative comment, that's a. Yeah. That missed entirely. But that's what I mean. So, this part of the game I don't really have any problem with, per se. Um, I think, from a mission structure and the story point of view. It's uninteresting. Quest design is uninteresting. They're all the same. Go to a place, shoot some things, wait for your timer to finish or whatever. Go to the next bit, shoot some things. Maybe put some orbs in a circle. Go to the next bit, shoot a bigger thing. You finish yeah, the mission. Yeah, but again, as you but said, that, that's like Destiny. That is all of these like games. These games. My oh, only problem really? with it in the sense of Anthem is because of being a Bioware game and being so story driven. The game itself doesn't drive the story. In this, no, that makes not sense. at all. Um, and it, and it, <laughs> I feel like it. I feel like this could be ten times better if it does. Whereas with other games of this style, I didn't. I didn't find that. Um, but also at the same time, it was the same problem with Destiny. I didn't care about the story in Destiny. Yeah. I didn't care because it's not presenting me in a way that I should care. I don't care about but the story this is, in this. That is but a, it's presented to me in a way as if I should care. But that is a large thing. Like it is presented as if the story is a. A bigger deal than it is, and obviously in the grand scheme of things, that's a problem because it's trying to make you care about the story. Oh, that was someone up there. Ooh, loot, shit loot, because it's white. But I'm kidding. So then, yeah. So my issues then come down to, you know, I'm not invested in the story. Not at all. I'm not invested in the gameplay because it's nothing groundbreaking or new to me. See, I do really. I am. Like, I enjoy this a lot. Even though it is very repetitive, even though it is... I don't have an issue with it being repetitive at all. But, yeah, even though it is very repetitive, even though it is, like, a lot of the same old shit, different skin yeah, yeah, in terms yeah. of what we've seen before. Oh, it's apparently directly underneath me. Yeah, so stuff like this, search for clues. You're not searching for clues, are you? You're going to the place you're telling me to go to and I'll get there and then you'll play an audio thing. And then you go to the next place you tell me to go to and I'll get there and you'll play an audio it's thing. It's not even telling me where to go right. on this time. There is no... There's no that's, that's, well, this, this time there isn't even an objective marker. So you're just like, searching for What things. I was saying about Metro and what we were saying on Press Start about where games need to guide you. Yeah. This guides you too much, I feel. Like yeah, uh, you're not doing anything day, for you're yourself. You're not meant to be in there oh, long. Not you're not, no, these no, missions aren't Which meant is to insane. Be you're not. The game is the gameplay bit, the main bit that's actually the good fun bit to play, you're not in for very long. And that, that's yeah, that just is bizarre. Madness. Like, that is utter madness the way they've done that. Wait. What are you talking about? You know, why can't I, why can't I come into here now? And being this, when I finish this mission, why do I have to go back? Why can't I now just yeah, stay in the free play and, and fuck about? Yeah, like, you, you have to come back. There should be an option at least, like, it comes up at the end of the mission, stay in free play. Yeah. Or go back through the fort, and it... 
it doesn't, and to be honest, there was an update an hour ago, and I don't know what that update was for. I highly doubt it was anything like that. Probably just some stability or something. Yeah, exactly, but... And now another loading screen. Oh. Or a wall. Or a wall. <laughs> or a wall. But now another loading and screen. And this is insane, loading screens within, like... Yeah. Did that amount of emission area we had was so small. Well, actually, that area was huge. But the area we actually had to be in wasn't. No, no, but the entire... You're in the entire outside world. But why? What's the point? Because if you're only in there to do that bit, you're not letting me free play, so why? Don't make it the whole fucking... If you can't fit your entire mission area into it because you put loads of redundant space I'm not going to go to in, don't put that redundant space in in this mission. Don't let Agreed. me get to it. It's just... It feels like a lot of Agreed. really poor game design to me. Yeah, and at the moment... I, I don't get me wrong. I'm not a game designer. These people got, clearly know far more about making games than I ever will. I don't deny that. But... There are things we have seen and we have learned as consumers, like hardcore consumers of games, about how a good game is executed, and I don't think this is doing it. No, there is a lot of dumb, dumb decisions revolving around this game. Oh, I strongly missed that. You did indeed. All these enemies are uninteresting as well to look at. They're just boring looking drones. Yeah, there aren't that many enemy types, there isn't much enemy And they don't variety. look interesting anyway. Also, they've got no hope against these big robotic suits. Uh, no, we've not yet recorded our Captain Marvel spoiler cast. It will be recorded and up sometime, I assume, within the week? Yeah. I imagine we'll, if we aim to get it out on Thursday. Yeah. So I don't know when we're going to do it. Uh, we'll, we'll discuss that later. Yeah. Because um, we're definitely going to have more people than just us. Yeah. Um... I don't know what I'm doing anymore, or what I was talking about, that is a wall. Oh yeah, I'm just... It is just go here, shoot enemies. Excellent! You get to see the riveting gameplay of being dead. <laughs> and waiting for someone to potentially respawn you. Oh, you have your respawn available anyway. So. Oh, do I? Oh. Yeah. Fuck that noise then. Oh, I should have waited. It would have been quicker. Oh, I you're imagine. in, don't worry, you're in. Oh. Right, but in terms, yeah, that's, there's so many like weird decisions made around this game, and you're just like, why have you done that? Mm. Why have you done that? This, as well, irritates me. Well, to be fair, that was fair enough. It wasn't, you were, you were, you were no more than, like, you were a few feet away. It's like, transporting to mission area! It is a lot better than it was at first. I know it is. <laughs> So they, ha they have been working on stuff, they have been fixing and stuff, and these are the sorts of problems you get. Uh, I didn't actually see you afterwards, Hannah. Um, okay. Yes, yeah, I did enjoy it. The reason it is ages away is because we've got... So, at the time this video is on YouTube as well, you have press start up Monday morning. This video will be up Tuesday morning. Um, plus, we have two reviews hitting the channel next week as well, which will all need to come in early part of the week because of the, where it's for. So, we have to uh, schedule accordingly. Indeed, and also yeah. we did an Aquaman, Aquaman spoiler cast like and released that after. straight away, and it, it bombed. No one watched it <laughs> because um, because obviously no one had seen it mm -hmm. mainly, so it's a bit of an issue when it comes to spoiler casts. Obviously, you have to leave it a while because many people don't watch it because they don't. They haven't seen it. Can it be open? Or am I going to have to do some nonsense? I imagine I'm going to have to do some nonsense. Yeah, there'll be one of those weird puzzle things we have to look at the colours that are being projected under the sea. I've never seen one of these before. Uh, go Red. behind you. No, go behind. Go go up that end. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Because I. Oh. I uh, fly, fly, fly. I already. I've stopped. Hover, hover, hover. Hover! Hover! You are not hovering. You are crashing repeatedly. Well, yeah. Uh, that's right. So yellow, out. purple, and okay. So behind you again. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Oh yeah, pick up that. Pick up that way. Yeah. That thing. That one up there, the red one. Yep. Go up to it. You can interact with it. Uh, you need to interact with it until that's yellow. Cool. And then go that's to green. the. Oh, it's green. Fuck. 
piss it. You've overheated. And it's the wrong can colour. So can someone... That one needs to be purple. The one there up there. And this one needs to be yellow. Bollocks to them all. <laughs> oh, that must have been yellow. That must have been yellow. Yeah. It did look a bit green, didn't it? Maybe it's just fucking TV. And then that one needs to be put that one purple. Stop it. Never seen one of those before. There's quite a few of those. Yeah, there's a lot of uninteresting puzzles. That aren't particularly clear. <laughs> no. <laughs> I did this mission the other day, that's why I knew that. No shit. A little bit, a little bit, a little bit. Not much life. <laughs> well, yes. There's no lives. There's jobs and podcasts yeah. to do, and reviews and editing, and, and we obviously got to edit all the other behind the scenes and shit. And obviously, got to pleasure Christian and all sorts. Find the researchers. Pretty sure we did. What? Yeah, you have to go back. It's for this mission is 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 a dick. What was the point of that? These people incapable of opening the fuck they got in. <laughs> but yeah, this is this is the game, guys. I don't know how long we can really talk about it for. Well, once we get out of this mission, we'll go and explore some other things, and we can talk about some other stuff. But oh, for fuck's sake! But that, but actually, that is one of my problems. So this is it. This is it. This is the game. I'm and sorry. Excuse me? You got shot, Jack. There was three of them shooting at you with their guns. Any of you got a bother or am I going to have to... Uh... He was totally about to bother. <laughs> <laughs> He's now thinking, oh, what a dick. She's going to respawn me. I did not do enough damage for the amount of effort to... Well, that's because this is hard mode, mate. Not the podcast hard mode. We don't have a podcast with hard mode. We have a segment. Let's give ourselves more work to do and have a podcast called hard mode. <laughs> there isn't the time! No, there isn't the fucking time. Or the wand. <laughs> I do like that super though. Boom! Fuck your mother! Up! Missed. No mothers were fucked. <laughs> That's definitely not true as a sentence. By definition, mothers were fucked. Well, yes. I'm not very good at this game either. It doesn't help the well, situation. It doesn't help you put it on hard mode. No, I was hoping to get better loot, but it would appear that I've got none, really. Hardly anything that's worth my time. Which is another problem with this game. The looting system is trash. Yep, and considering it's a uh, shooting loot. That is very much What's like a... I, again, this just goes back to... The core things of this game aren't good enough to me to retain my attention and the only thing about this game that I thought would retain my attention was the multiplayer element and being able to play it with guys from work and you and Tom etc but that has there, also it not breaks happened it, up too much it does break up fort, which is yeah. all single player shit yeah and you're just like what is this nonsense yeah no that's exactly it no it doesn't oh. And the story just isn't interesting, really, mm -hmm. to be perfectly honest. I haven't honest. found any of the characters we talked to over the interesting either, to be totally I like honest some with you. Of them. I don't really understand what a lot of the interactions in the fort are, like, what they're doing. This irritates me. This goes on for an age, telling me information that I don't fully understand. You like, can skip it. I know it does. I know. I know you can. Well, I understand what? everything. Okay, so, what's that mean? Because we're all a soldier, apparently. What does that mean? To be fair, I don't know what the medals are. Right, well, there you go. What are all these little symbols? What the fuck Those do they mean? Those medals are you achieving different things. Yes, it doesn't explain what you've achieved. Yeah, but it doesn't tell what they are. Like, it doesn't just... explain what you've achieved. Somehow, some that guy somehow got less. This is how many people... So your alliance is how many people in your friends are playing. Yeah. And obviously, the more they contribute... Yeah. So I... they go, our alliance is now level two. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Now... Because of the people that are contributing. Uh, oh, I pressed the button. That's fine. All is well. Just skip. Just press skip. Skip it, skip it. And, and that's all the loot, loot I picked up. Uh, I might, do, you, do you want me to bother fucking around with this or shall I just... No, I'll just carry on. I'll cool. fuck around. 
And now we have the option to go to the launch bay to forge or Fort Tarsus. I have another mission, so if you want to go to the launch bay, you All right, can go let's to just the launch bay. Let's do that. So basically, the launch here is where the, the fort is basically where we were, that first person mode. Oh, it's the why tower. is it first person yeah. and so slow? That's a different thing. The forge is where we were customizing the javelins. Yeah. And the launch bay is basically a quick version. You can go in and do everything from there, but you don't have to deal with all the conversations and stuff. Yeah, but like you that. can't go to the fort and get more. If you need to get more missions, you if can't you need to go, go you have to get go more missions, you fort. have to go back to the fort, which defeats the entire fucking point. The, of the only thing bay. I can see from the launch bay is it allows you to go in and it allows you to go to the forge. You can walk to the fort from there, but what else can you do from the launch bay? You can go to your vault. Oh, okay. And you can go to the stores. Okay, okay, all right. So you can do pretty much everything there other than get, other new, than missions, get new missions. Okay. Which you should be able to do. There should be a bounty board or a yep. contracts board in there. there. Yeah, that 100%, makes sense. 100%, there should be that in there. Uh, I can understand the story missions not necessarily because you need to have those conversations to progress the story because that's the only form of story progression per se. Yeah. Um, there's, there's a few cutscenes, but nothing. Yeah, no, I follow you up. I agree with you on that one. Nothing major. Which again is another disappointing thing. Like they're straddling this weird line between single player Bioware story game and this division destiny style yeah. loot and shoot and it just doesn't compete. So this is the launch bay which is not... in third person. You yes. cannot fly. No, but you can you, you can do everything else. Other than shoot and stuff. You, so know, you feel can walk free to jump. change a javelin if you want. Oh, no, I'll, you've I'll... never played as anything other than No, which is why I shall stay with the Ranger. Fair enough. <laughs> Because I vaguely know what I'm doing. So how do I? Oh, she just hold start the next mission. Okay. Okay. Yeah. And then if you want to go and finish this next mission, follow Yara. You can walk up into here, and I'll take you into Fort Tarsus, and you can go and do. Oh, does it? That. So does the other way. Oh, interesting. Interesting. And then this is where you forge, where you can fucking play about with your. Yeah, your bolts on the other side. Okay. And there's the stores there as well. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, cool. Um. Oh, I don't know what that is actually. In front I've, of you. I've, I've, I've. You have no other missions. What? It was definitely there. You are a liar. It's there. Oh. Call me a liar. Well, I thought you were lying. I apologise. Damn fucking straight. You are a liar and a traitor to the rebel of That's not the line. I Star Wars. Um, what is it? What does he say? Sis don't deal in absolutes. Only Sis deal in absolutes, which in itself is an absolute. So everyone is a Sith. <laughs> That's a very good point. That's a very good point. Very, like, I know we say good point, well presented. No, good point, well made. Good point, well made. But that is a very good point. Generally very well made. Mm, mm. I stole it off the internet. <laughs> <laughs> Not a brainchild of mine. <laughs> um, so, welcome to what is 80% of Anthem. Oh, loading screen, loading screen, loading screen. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I might make the thumbnail for this video just a loading screen. <laughs> I mean, fuck it. <laughs> Probably get some clicks. <laughs> it's just... Oh, it's madness, isn't it? Utter madness. How long it takes. And how often it does it. Mm -hmm. <sighs> yeah, it's infuriating. <sighs> That was unnecessary. Jack had a crisis. <laughs> oh my god, there is fire. Fire is gone. Fire is gone. Alright, we're going this way. Fucking hell, you took off quickly there. <laughs> I'm about to fuck around standing. <laughs> the... Oh, there's only three of you. I don't give a monkeys. I don't one. even know if they're following you, to be perfectly honest. Okay, we need a drop so I can call. I've gone too far! Oh. <laughs> See, this is, the scenery is so cool. The yeah. world, the physical world is so cool. The Zenit turrets, we need to take them down. The flying is probably the best part of this game. Yet it keeps taking it away from me. I mean, one point to make. More about oh the my. way you do gameplay videos. No, I pause it a lot. You pause it to make a point, which... 
It's mainly because if I... I, I know it's distracting to <laughs> talk and play at the same time, but given the fact we're making a gameplay video... Yeah, yeah, I'm still learning this stuff. <laughs> Where is everyone gone? See, and this fucks me because I, I fly a lot as part of my combat. Yeah. But I can't now. Flight yeah. has been disabled, and that really irritates me. I don't understand why there are flight suspension modes. It is, it's weird. It's like Detroit removing chat. There's no way they caught without the bridge. They must be gating. For this level, we have taken away your options. What? Any energy signatures in the courtyard? Head for the fortress doors. Oh no, Can't flight fly. is still disabled. Still disabled. Why? Why is it? Flight and respawning have been disabled. Two major parts. <laughs> Next one. Guns have been disabled. Well, shit on it. We've got your abilities. The delayed response to some of the shots as well as always. This is very much a... Oh no! A burst rifle, isn't it? Yeah, both okay. of them are. Okay, yeah. I, I know that now. As long as I know that, then I like it. The gate's connected to those anchors. Break that and we shut this down. Do I shoot you? Yeah. That's it. Take them all out and we can cut off the Dominion reinforcements. That dialogue was fucking terrible. What? Also, whenever you're reloading, your gun just shoots in the air. That's weird. It doesn't make any sense. I'm still icy, but yet I'm moving. I like that colour, though. I like I'll colour, lick though. your mum! That is a viable option, I suppose. Blue loot! I seem to be the only person actually... Good work. Don't let up. Piss! I've been frozen by my own <laughs> freeze. Frozen by my own <laughs> freeze, yes. I seem to be the only person to... Uh... Yeah, I just noticed what you were saying about the gun shooting in the air if I shoot whilst I'm reloading. Yeah, it's weird. What is this purple thing? What is it? Oh, it's where shit spawning. spawning up. They all, all enemies spawn in the same way, it's just a different colour whittle. A little different colour wiggly bit in the screen. Uh, it feels a bit laggy, I don't know if that's just the in there. Yeah, it's probably just the internet, to be honest. Or the TV, it might be the poor TV. Look at that thing, Was that that is highly possible. Find the mechanism. If oh, I'm right, fuck you with my sword and You're not like leaving, it's just stopped. See, that makes no sense. Yeah. Fuck it. Hold square, that's another favourite thing of this game. More loading, boys! Transporting to mission. I was at the mission area, the others weren't. No, I think that's what you're holding square for. Oh, I see. I think you were loading inside this fort. Yeah, there you go. Welcome to the fortress of dark. I can't we have flying back rats, we must fly. You're the first to stand in this spot for centuries. Look around. I bet. I guarantee you there are enemies in here. Which would completely de the defeat the point of that, and they won't mention it. Yep. I swear I've seen this design before. Behold the doors of might. Whosoever just... wishes them open. Place Me? your signet, the trial of might. Place your will separate the weak from the worthy. Put your dick in it. So it says Arden Vassar. Just going interact Arden with a hundred different things. Oh, Luke. Where? Really Where? <gasps> that looks like you can plug the signet in, doesn't what it? What's that for? What is it? This is a cutscene. Oh, progression! Ooh. <laughs> well, do enjoy, thank you for tuning in. If you do feel like catching up on the rest of this, you can find it on YouTube. Indeed. Indeed. Do, 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 do. I said that's a fast. Rather hold me to do it, okay, in a normal speed. Have a flare! <laughs> And the amount of Prove options in terms of like truly personal, obviously like Tarsis. there's no one else in the Bring universe that has a range of this foe. vibrant. May your might prevail but against the darkness. like the amount of emotes you have, the different pieces of armor, the um, stuff like that, and the vinyls you can put on your suits, it's just so limited. Oh, oh, I think that is a shoot it thing. You are a big man. Defeat the Titan. Also, if we're the first thing to come I'll in crash. here in 600 years, is this, is this thing 600 years old? No, we're I just would, gonna rock up and shoot it today. I would ask it, but it's getting, it's got flaming hands and whatnot, and it's just making me a bit uncomfortable. When did you? Oh, 
Can we use the orb? No, no, I just don't seem to have one. Oh, good. You can use your abilities, you know. I am using my abilities. You're out of our switch. Shit. So small, couldn't see that. Mine is shocking. Am I? I've actually blown into the fire. Loot! More fire. You passed the test. Before your might, the greatest of foes crumble. Yet more trials lie before you, Lancer. Oh, it's too hot Go to forth. fly. May okay, the path sense, lead you to the dawn. Exit the gate. So we're just going back again. So this is my big, big problem with these missions. Let's just go there, kill that, come back. That's what I was saying. Yeah. You didn't even make it. And is that is that the mission done, or is there another part of this mission? I don't know. Oh, there's more. Oh, there's more. Connections reestablished. Cover the javelin of dawn. I fought it tight, but I never left this spot somehow. It's a gateway to us. That's why I'm not sunning. Whatever it is, I used to. Oh, I've crashed. Come on, Slow Cokes. Oh, something else has happened now. This is weird. I'm not really sure what's going on. I think you're going into different dimensions. The path comes to an end for you here, as it did for our general, as it does for us all. Your inevitable oh, death that was awaits fucking you, bizarre. Lancer. Let's go. go to face it. Wait, wait. Path comes to an end. Is this is this the last stand of General Tarsus? Just gotta stay within this great wall. Hello, doggy things. It seems to be like traveling through time and stuff. I don't really understand. Why have you abandoned me? We have to stand in this area. Shot. Sure. I know they're homing, but <laughs> even so, it was cool. We must be here. Look where the flare is. Yeah, but your teammates are asses. All they care about is getting kills and potential loot. You've got loot over there. Where? 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 No, look at the guy. The I crashed again. Ah, there's not enough wood to make this worth my wall. To raise us to me to helpless oh. Antium. Well, Tarsus took only a handful of nuts. There's not a button to do like I a mid-air U-turn. Yeah, that would be awesome. If it was strabby. And yet, Tarsus held her ground. There's so many things that they haven't done. Which are, what do you mean, transport to mission? Oh, I have to go back here again. Why? Why? Why have you put all the enemies down there when we have to be here? It's stupid, isn't it? Well, I don't. I think they would come up, but because everyone else has run down there, they're just staying down stupid there. Stupid game design. Yep. There are so many just odd decisions that I don't quite understand. What is this? You can have these. You can have my missiles. I didn't even shoot them. I just shot in the air automatically after I died. Uh... Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's really weird. You know you can aim that grenade properly. I know you got them and didn't miss, but I'm just saying. Oh, I didn't. I didn't miss you. So you can do that, huh? Yeah. Narrow mountain pass. The legionnaires stood against the might of the I'd... Urgoth Hall. What? For if they wavered, that went in your favor somehow. Well, I'm not entirely <laughs> sure. Antium would fall, and countless others with it. Also, look how slowly the time thing's going up. Oh, that's, that's that is definitely is. my guy. <laughs> Bit of loot there as well. I'm pretty sure even if you don't pick it up, you get it. You probably just get it at the end, yeah. Destiny doesn't get that end. Yeah. Because otherwise, how annoyed would you be if you just missed yeah. it? Tarsus met dumb. the Urgos leader in battle. But there's still these people to do murdering. Even as Tarsus knew yeah. her life was ending, she fought on, 
as her life's blood ebbed. I just saw a shot out and didn't really look at what was going on. It was someone was dead. Yeah, I realised. In hindsight, I was like, oh. Oh, hello. Big bastards. Oh, I'm out of ammo again. Murder! See, I feel like that would kill you. This is another thing. Oh, no. No, no, no. I don't... So we've been recording... for 38 minutes. See. So probably... actually live... for... 4... 45? 15 no, minutes? What have we achieved in that time? It's mostly loaded and just fiddling about and stuff. We just, just don't get much done for the time. I don't know what I just did. I I just... No, I don't know what you just did either. You yeah. don't really get much time done for the time you put in. And it's just a waste. Really? Yep. You just waste your time loading and all sorts of shit. There's no PvP in this either, is there? No. Well, apparently that is coming though, I don't know how true that is. It shouldn't be coming, it should be here. Yeah. But, I'm gonna... S I will stick with this game, just because I want to see how it progresses and stuff like that. I'll but it's not going to be a game I full on sit down and commit. I'll hop in, yeah, I'll I do think some missions, get some other. Oh, oh chest! Oh, lovely. I think if break. there wasn't right. other games out that I had more interest in playing at the moment, I would have kept it. But you. Well, yeah, past I wanted to play uh, another game. This door. was going to fund it. I wasn't care about this. I didn't want to be playing this. It was just kind of present. Yeah, exactly. Um, I'll, be, I'll be playing this. I'll be playing it alongside other things. I'll be dabbling. And in terms of the big online game, I'm. You're back. Truly what commit happened? to it will probably be the division. You're standing on crisps. I'm standing on the empty part. Oh, empty. empty. No, I'm the empty oh, I see. part of the bag. Um, but yeah, we'll, like, we'll do another. Jesus. We'll do another. Are you going to be getting the division? Uh, I definitely will not be getting it at launch. Fair enough. So it'll be more of a. I show you the Behold game type the thing. Oh, that's fair. That's fine. Yeah, I didn't really play the first one, um, and. Place your sickness. Timing wise, the trial of makes valor no sense for me. shall separate the true lancers from the false. Those. Why do my mom just so send me a text message that says WTF? Fair. I don't know if I can do this. You might have to question. Many question if she even knows what that means. Where's the fridge? Hey, <laughs> this is what are all about. I can't interact with this. There you no, go. Okay. You have to wait for them to stop. Uh, yeah, uh, timing of it is a little bit weird, monetary wise and whatnot. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'll be getting in and do a stream on it and stuff like that, but... This stuff is so weird, I have no idea what's going on. You come to the final test. Prove your valour. A great calamity dwelled in the heart of the land, threatening to unweave the fabric of the world itself. She said, the film so just Helena ended, dot dot dot, dust dot dot dot. In its own lair, They've seen it, didn't strongest it? I'm confused. It's rampage forever. Maybe Go so. forth, the Lancer. Uh, Seek out and you know. stop disaster in its tracks, if you dare. How? I, I don't even have a weapon. You don't need one. What is going on? It's not working. You're about to get eaten. I'll put you back into it. Got it. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. The path of valor is well-traveled ground for you, I think. What the fuck is this? Ah, um... <clears throat> I can't move. The suit's overheating. I'm gonna die! Stay calm or you're locked up. This is meant to be the future. You have been tested. Again and again. I'm very confused. Yeah, me too. This is the thing, it presents the stories of something <laughs> you should really care about. Yeah. But it doesn't explain it very well. Oh, it's just spawning inside me! Are you actually moving around? Yeah, I'm doing this. You're past the point of testing now. I know, my there cinematography was so good that you would assume it was a cutscene. <laughs> 
Remember this. Might can conquer a moment. Resolve can outlast That shield is not covering anything must renew it's, of it's covering this arm. Walk the path, Lancer of... That is definitely because the host. Oh, I probably should have turned notifications. Probably. Off. Oh well, you now know that person's <laughs> username. Um, <laughs> yeah, it's strange uh -huh. because obviously we're clearly not the host in that situation. What is going on? Okay, we just got more loading screen. Oh, fucking! I I sorry. I'm sorry. I hate this game. I. Fucking hate it. <laughs> I disagree with you, but yeah. It's just it's so slow. It doesn't make any sense. Oh, we've because done... we're th th it's, this is dumb. But because we're not the host, the person who is the host finished ah, first. That was fast. Finished that bit Actually, first. That took two years to get through. Wait, this is the first time we've had other people in the cutscene. So far. Is that what I think it is? I don't know. What do you think it is? General Tarsus is javelin. There you go. I see. I've been mildly following on. Hey, Hallett, I can barely hear you. Hey, you seeing this? Hey, are you there? They can't hear you. Oh, wait. No. Oh, dear. Javelin not working, huh? Spoilery. Yeah, whoops. Owen's a prick. Click. What the hell are you doing? Isn't it obvious? How did he get there? I have no idea. Hi. He wasn't talking to you this time. I bet it stings of mold in there. Nice. <laughs> Was unnecessary. I mean, I would do that. Like one of those. No more waiting. Come up with me on the I mean, side. I live nothing but a ten minutes walk away, but I insist on driving. How can you help the Dominion? You know what they've done. I know exactly what they've done. Beat them. What a shit twist. Mm. Owen, stop! At least Bioware have worked on their uh, facial animations. Damn it! That was indeed a very vivid costume. It is, yes. It's very... Uh, how do you say... See, everything else had faded to black except for your javelin. <laughs> there was still just glowing illuminance. Let me have this back. Oh, so much loading! I got a trophy though. It's quite exciting. Is it? No. Okay. Do you know this is a really easy platinum? Except for all the loading you have to do. <laughs> there is a trophy of sit through 40 hours of loading. <laughs> done. Which I've nearly done, yes. Yeah, that was the end of the mission. Is there anything else we need to talk about, really? What haven't we talked about? We, we haven't really spoken about the different classes and how different they are. Oh shit, we should have... Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Pick yeah. different... Well, let's just... Let's, let's grab a different class, jump into free play for a little bit, have a look at see how the class is different, and then we'll fuck off. Yep. <laughs> Sounds good. Oh, hot damn. Many different things. Many different things. Indeed! More loading! Yeah. Yeah! Jack, before we fuck around with this bit. Yep. How would you score this? 
7.5, maybe 7. The thing is, though, the gameplay to me is like an 8, an 8.5, 8.5. But everything else brings it down like an entire point, and you're just like... Bacon says 5. I didn't even know you were still fucking here, Jack, me, mate. Bacon, tell me in a few sentences or a few words in the comments why a 5 and what you don't like about Anthem, and what you do like about Anthem, if anything. Go! All the fucking loading. I mean, yeah, I can't argue with that. So, yeah, I think most of us have sold them now, but that's not a reason as to why it's a five. I rate this game a five because I sold it. The thing is that I prefer this to games like Destiny. Or at least I will. Gameplay is really good. And I think the gameplay is better than Destiny. That's the thing. I agree with that. No, I completely agree with that. I think gunplay feels better in Destiny, but overall gameplay is... Yeah, but that's because Destiny is about guns. Yeah. Um, we need to get the but I... Yeah, I, something to stop them. I do think the gameplay in this is better than Destiny. Jack agrees it's better than Destiny. Focus on what's up ahead. Um, Where I am, but they just need to the work on so many little things. Like I think I down the line what this happened? game will be banging. Hey, but obviously... Bah, that's a too little too late thing again. That's <laughs> It's not though. Destiny when it came oh, out was trash. Which one? Again. One or two? <laughs> one. Yeah. Uh, but then it, yeah. it got really good over a year later. But um, uh, see, I don't fully agree that Destiny was trash when it came out. I think Destiny in the long game was trash. I think the initial release of Destiny was like, uh, oh, this is really good. And then before we hit the updates. So like the initial impact, like the initial beginning of Destiny was like, oh, interesting, good storyline, I think. No. And really? Was, I, Story that's what... was so boring. Gameplay variety was none. The levelling yeah, system yeah, was confusing and convoluted because they hadn't explained seen. anything. <laughs> yeah, that was and the, then that was there true. was nothing. There was yeah, literally the, nothing. It was when it's, to me, it was when there was nothing is when the big problem was because I got into Destiny. So many issues when it, was when it came out. Well, performance-wise. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, so it's, it's in the same... Well, what people are forgetting... I'm sorry, I Destiny is on a Destiny 2 now because it shouldn't be. It shouldn't have to be. No. That's the point. Well, originally Bungie said Destiny was going to have a 10 year support cycle. Exactly. 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 It fucked it. It fucked it hard. You don't get people going on about that. I don't give a shit. Um, <laughs> fucked it hard, and you don't get people going on like that about Destiny. They're mm. just digging into this and I guarantee they're digging into this. Because it's EA. Because it's EA. Oh, yeah, yeah. I completely agree. And then, But this is having the same teething problems that every game in this genre has. The lack of... A lack of content, a lack of polish, for honour, siege. It's mad how that lands. happens, though. Like, how does that happen so consistently? Like... I don't understand that. I don't understand how all these games continuously to come out with the same problems every time and take so because long. Because you before can't test them. You can't test how a game is going to run. Not performance-wise, though. Like lack of content and stuff like that. How how is that keep getting missed? Well, because how do you know how much to put in? What, you've done this it is a game where you say games. lack of content, but it's still sixty or more hours. How do you know how much people's gonna? How do you know how much people are gonna just jump into it? How do you know how you can't? How do you know how quickly people are gonna get through the story and go into the end game? How do you? Know, and people who have figured it out. I would argue because of what you said about there being every other every game in this genre having the same problem. That's how you should be able to figure that. You should be looking I'm at. Go to the f you should be looking at what's made Destiny good now, what's made Siege good now, what's made Wildlands good now. This stuff. That's what we need to be. We need to be copying. Yeah, no, that but that's format. so game specific. In what way? Like, well, the stuff meaning? that makes Siege good now isn't going to be the stuff that makes Anthem good. But what what what, what make? I, I'm not too clued up on what's going on in Siege nowadays, so what? what's... Uh... Well, Siege is a first-person shooter, isn't it? So yeah, you yeah. can't just copy what they're doing. 186! Fuck, that's low. I could have sworn it was higher than that. Okay, well then let's use a game that's closer to this, Destiny. 
Well, yeah, it's just a hundred. I swear I was higher than this on every front. <laughs> What's my storm on? Oh, okay, it was my storm. Let's be storm. Um. I'm sorry, I'm going to have to be mad unprofessional and you're going to have to waffle and set things that I really need to pee. <laughs> <laughs> like, I can't think straight on that based on how much I need to pee. Talk with Jack. Jack's going to go pee. It's probably a good thing because I think he's fucking mad. This game's a four. It's not a four. I, I, I'd, I'd say 6.5 to 7. We will discuss properly uh, the thing you were saying a minute ago. Okay. Okay. Don't be long. I just saw a spider come in the ship. It's in the door. It's gone. Front. It's gone out. It's gone out. It's gone out. <laughs> All right. Let's, let's see if we can actually fucking do some game. Let's run into a free play. Find fucking. I've broken the thing. Find out what is what. Also, this is shit. Why can't I move? This is shit. All right. Fucking let me, let me pick. I haven't actually played as any other classes on this game yet, so this will be interesting. More loading. We have this thing on Rabbit Hole where if someone leaves mid filming, we sort of leave a little surprise for Jack to find. Um, my surprise for Jack to find this time should be this. Oh my god, we've been doing this for hours. Um, an hour. An hour. <laughs> and I'd, I reckon, I'm going to go for and count how much of this hour of video is loading screen. I'm going to do that in post. I hear noise, he's coming back. Oh my god, it is a man! Did somebody order <laughs> sex? And all that usual shit. <laughs> right. I like how you checked for the spider as you came in. <laughs> The spider, as you opened the door and came back, look at it, ran out the inside of the hinge. So it's back outside somewhere. Or I crushed it in the door. Or, it's, or it's on you. Don't. Don't. I will get naked and lose my shit. This, this loading screen is, but you're going to get, get naked and shit yourself. I said lose my shit. It's going to fall out of your bowel. I am doing more loading screens. Uh, so. The reason it's difficult is because, obviously, if you're going to add more content... Like a shit ton more content for the end game pre launch, mm -hmm. you're gonna have to decide what people are going to like. Mm -hmm. for, uh, other than finding out what people like, and then that's what you add more of. Mm -hmm. Like, yeah, okay, you can add more. You can add more strikes or something like that, but. What should really be happening is there are these content, and then there are like weekly events and stuff. Yep. Weekly thing. That's the way you do it. Weekly events, monthly bigger events, and that's that's the way you should do it. But yeah, obviously, all things. of these games just kind of pick. What was that? All of these games just do a certain amount of content, and that's going to be another loading screen. Thank you. Um, I don't know things to do. Yeah, it's weird. There you go. Roll event. Holy shit! Yeah, your dodging is teleporting them from this guy. Okay, cool. Wish I'd known that earlier. So, what class is this? This is Storm. Storm, yeah. So, the, all the different javelins are really cool. The design of everything is really fucking cool. Once again, loading screen. Well, it's unavoidable, isn't it? Yep. Jack said, "Called in your asshole." I assume he is referring to the spider. Probably. But I can feel a tickle. So my point was, was I, I'm not very good at making these points. But my point is, as you said, that it suffers from the same problems that all games in this genre suffer with. 
that wouldn't fly with other genres. Well, with this though, with this, you're trying to create a game that lasts years, as opposed to finish it and get it done. So obviously, the, if the problems had with what? What is this? Oh, sorry, you've got a sniper. Uh, a shotgun. Oh, good. Yeah, I forgot I made him a shotty sniper. Sorry. Um, you got this. Oh, that was, that was pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, so now that you... With, with a game like God of War and The Last of Us, I know they're very different, but they're within the same sort of genre. To a degree. I don't think they're different to each other. They're different to this. I wouldn't say they're particularly different to each other. Ah, oh, this is mine! Oh, right. Um, obviously, they're kind of... This is the game, this is the package. And then... The story base and... Problems you have with other genres are more technical. Mm -hmm. Than anything. Mm -hmm. And obviously, yes, all these games suffer from technical problems. But that's just what these games are, because they're entirely online based. They're entirely... Um, servers based and... Not you can't push those to the extent they're going to get pushed to. So I understand those sorts of issues, but... The reason this genre kind of gets away with it, to an extent, is because, um... Well, you just have... I don't know what's going on. It's the ultimate. I don't understand what you're doing. That it's pretty, pretty, pretty insane. Pretty banging. So, what? Because they're so different from each other as well. That's the, they're, what, they're the same in principle, and you and making the same mistakes and stuff like that. Because they're so different from each other that it's not just a you can't so not much learn you need to stay close. from what the others have done because this well, doesn't I, necessarily apply. I think to an extent you can, in the sense to that an extent, sure. you can. You can look at games like Destiny and go, okay, what is it people like about Destiny now? They like, they have all these daily events and things like that. They like the PvP has these different yes, events. Of course. They and like the raids and the strikes and the, I can't do shit about that. And um, they're getting awfully close. The, and the more varied options to the upgrade system and things like that. Blah, 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 blah. That's what, people, that's what brings people back. The reason, the fact that there is a, these, there's reasons to repeat missions and you can, you know, all those different things that this game has not yet done. You can look yeah, at that I and will. go... But... And as you say, it took Destiny. They didn't get that right either. That's it. You're back in range. They didn't get that right straight away either. But eventually, they got it. But Bioware have clearly taken a lot of heavy influence from games like Destiny for this. Yep. Like, anyone who says otherwise, frankly, is a tool. Mm -hmm. um, so why have they not looked at that as well and gone, well, people didn't like this part of Destiny. People didn't like this part of Destiny. Yeah, but so people have looked back at the presentation the stream they did on Anthem where he had like... I don't understand how... Where he had like 40 helmets... That's a shield. Where he had like 40 yeah, helmets in this thing and 16 different choices of arms. And people are now just thinking they're holding stuff back for content drops, mm -hmm. which is dumb. They, I will say they've made a lot of dumb decisions in terms of the upgrade system. Oh god, oh my god. The upgrade system and the um, customization systems and stuff like that, they, and the looting system. Like that, those are the issues where I'm just like, okay, you should have learned from those. And how have you let it get this bad? Yeah, that's kind of like but what I mean as well. in terms of the amount of content there are, I think it's kind of hard to determine. It's kind of hard to... I, in any game, it's event. hard to tell how long your game is actually going to take in in, pra in principle. You can kind of get a rough idea, but it is... Yeah, I get that. I get that. And that's something in any, any game of any, any genre. That's not specific to this. I completely agree. But, yeah, the, the lack of, like, events, like, proper events... Obviously, there's these world events that are going on, but a lack... Lack of proper events and stuff like that. It's just weird. Yeah, like, it's like this game was completely, even though it's 
so obviously developed for based on things like Destiny and Division was obviously mild, a mild influence because it's just a game of this genre. And this is going to go continuously be badly for me, I feel. And all sorts of things. You just, it kind of also feels like it was just made in a bubble. Mm -hmm. And it's, it's so weird. Well, basically, I think some of the issues have gone so, so heavy with Anthem. Because I think, personally, this was meant to be a standard Bioware game. Yeah, I think you're right. You were saying this earlier. Piss. Uh, this was meant to be a standard Bioware game, and EA made it so it would be one of these loot and shoot games, shoot and loot, which one hundred and ninety-one percent should not be. It should be. A single-player, story-driven experience along the lines of Mass Effect. Oh, you cocking serious. But they've just made the really bizarre experience to not bother with that. Oh, I missed. fell off. Oh, are you kidding? Reloading. Fucking Christ. Massive Jesus. According to this report, they had instructions to set up How long is this world event as well? Blown. Jesus. I also like this spin. To be fair, it is you doing it on your own. Alright, oh, fair enough. I imagine this will be quicker if there are other people. But, uh, yeah. When I'm playing this game, like, when I'm playing it, I really enjoy it. There's just so many weird issues. There's so many weird decisions. Like, as I said, it feels like it was made in a bubble. Mm -hmm. Ignoring everything all of these games have done before. And you're just like, with this genre of game, with this game that's, with a genre that's so reactionary, that's so develop it with, with the consumers, with the gamers. Oh my god, what did I do? It's just so odd to have such a vacuum around where it thinks that none of the decisions, none of the things that Bungie learned by having that first game not be so fantastic, by having it take a year until The Taken King came out mm -hmm, mm -hmm. for that game to take off. Well, obviously it had its fan base like this, just like this will, and I, I do believe that this game will get great. It will fix all of these issues, it will lower the loading times, it will have you... Yeah. It will have loads of content to create. The one thing I, that they have made on good faith, which I think will be the sole reason this game actually has legs, is the fact that the content is free. Agreed. I think if they were doing a Destiny model, which I think is obscene, that <laughs> model, that game is so expensive to go all in on, um, this game would die. Mm -hmm. This game would die, because no one would come back and check on your content, whereas... The same way that The Division lost so many players, because, um, because obviously the Division 1 had similar issues where um, people weren't overly amazed with the core gameplay, with the core game, the vanilla Division, that it lost a lot of players by the time the DLC came around. But I think the people will come back and see how has Anthem progressed? Because all the content is free. Mm -hmm. So I think that is literally the only reason this game is going to have legs, which is right. unfortunately like destiny. entirely their fault. Yeah. Well, as I said, as much as I'm having a blast right now. 
but that's literally right now. As soon as this mission ends and we've got to load our way back out the cave, it's going to be a for fuck's sake. Check your phone. And you... They're getting awfully close. Listen back. Oh, they're getting awfully close. That was quite sick, actually. Um, God, it's hard to talk and play at the same This is something it we is. need to practice at. That's why I pause. <laughs> but I will be interested, and I think down the line, after like a content drop or something, we should revisit. Oh, definitely. Definitely. Revisit on the stream or in the channel. And see what they've done, because I'll be progressing... Like, as I said, oh my I, god, I, there are a lot of enemies. I'm actually really fond of this game, to be perfectly honest. See, I really, really enjoyed the, the VIP demo, so I thought I was going to be far more into it, but... But the VIP demo was such a bite size that you don't realise the yeah. shit around it. And and I don't think anyone disagrees when you say that the gameplay is great. No. No, no, no I don't disagree with that at all. Okay, so now we've got that. All that's done. I'm gonna go and get. Well, and this is another problem. What's gonna be in here? No, not much. So when it actually tells me what loot I get. Rare A common item. Yeah, come on. Two common items. That's it. All of that. Useless to someone of my. I'm not a high level. At all, I'm level 18, the cap's 30, but I'm also 283 in terms of like javelin power. I don't know what the cap is in javelin power, no, to I be do. perfectly honest. Um, but that's that stuff is already useless to me. Right, let's wrap up. Because this has now been going on for an age. I agree, I agree. What are your, your final thoughts? Uh... Your final... Your, Condensed opinion. Did you mean to put the lower thirds up? Uh, I knew they were to turn on. Oh, okay. Um, this is how the videos end, right? Yeah, true. True. My final thoughts are, as I said, I think the core gameplay is fun and interesting and something I would like more of. Mm -hmm. However, there is too much beating around the bush and not enough to make me want to go back and keep playing it and enough to make me put up with the things I don't like to make it worth my while. I agree. I admit that, to be fair. And having good, having good gameplay, although it's a game that's important, having good gameplay is only part of a gaming experience. It needs to have a good story that I care about and you make me care about in a good way. It needs to have a good progression system. It needs to have, if it's a loot system, it needs to have a good coherent loot system. If it's online, it needs to have consistent online capabilities, which makes sense. Um, and I feel like they're all things it's missing. The only thing I think as done right is the gameplay, the core gameplay works, but all the other things I think it's missed the mark and then I don't care. That's just that's just the way it is. When there are other, when there are so we're, we're so saturated with games nowadays, oh, right? It's really loud. We can probably hear it. It's so saturated with games nowadays. There's so many games of varying different types and genres. So many multiplayer things now as well. And simply saying, oh, I'm going to sit and play this game with my friends now, isn't easy because everyone's playing so many different games. Who do I play with? What do they fancy playing? I really get you. Uh, so actually, many, just so to, many just options. Just to prove a point. Flip back to the game screen. That's just my multiplayer shit that I want to get done. We've got Black Ops 4, Modern Warfare Remastered was just on the yep. um, PlayStation Plus, Apex came out, Anthem came out, Battlefield 5 I've hardly touched. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I mean, Titanfall 2 was dirt cheap, that's not part of the conversation anymore, and Injustice I just play with Ace from time to time, so <laughs> that's not really part of the conversation either. But look at that! And then, on top of that, you go into the single player stuff mm -hmm. I'm trying to play. I've got so much that to do. I want to catch up on those before Ultimate Lights 3 comes out on Switch. Spyro, fuck it, Spyro, and these I've just been kind of playing. Yep. This is a terrible... And then Devil May Cry has just come out, I've been playing that. Um, I'm done with this. And then we got Division coming soon. Division is the next week. Yeah. Six days away. <laughs> it's, it's six <laughs> days away, and so I'm going to be doing that as well. I'm going to be diving into that. 
Days Gone isn't that far either. I know it's end of April, but that will come around really come fucking around so quick. quick. And uh, yeah, in that t- I know that this game isn't going to take up all of my time because other things are going to come out and play. Mm-hmm. But it's not doing enough to make my time to make its time worth my while. That's yeah. that's that's my overall feeling with it. I know. Um, as I said, I do think we should revisit it, even like on a stream or something. We when should definitely revisit it and new content out, comes out and new updates go along and see what happens with stuff like that. Um, but yeah, I mean, you pretty much hit the nail on the head. Like I know, while we're playing, our conversations a bit inco- incoherent and all over the place because <laughs> we're getting distracted by what's going on on the screen, and then we're just bouncing off of each other. You, someone will bring up a point, and then you'll make another point, and then and then you you respond to that point. And while you're making that point, you'll think of another one. Yeah, it's incoherent. But now that we're at the end, we can like the gameplay is fucking great. Yeah, no, it's it it's definitely really is. good. It's new. It's interesting. It's a new way. I like the powers. All right, so, but there are so many limitations on. I have a proper flick. There's also so much rain happening. Yeah, there is. Um, I don't know if you can hear that, but... The loading is obscene. The customization, like, they've got... Customization is both so good in some elements, it's so good and so detailed, and then bare bones mm-hmm. in the rest of it. Like, I don't... Why are there three options for the for the armour? Yeah. What's, what's the fucking point? And then why... So there's three options for the armor, um, but you have all these with materials and and the color schemes and everything. You can get so deep and so personal, and you're just like, but, but, but I want to change the helmet. I want to change the arms, my chest, my the legs for the javelins. I want to do that. I want to have a few options for emotes and stuff like that. I want to have a few options for my favorite thing. Abilities. Also, you, I feel like you get fuck all loot. You don't get much loot. And for this genre, that's insane! Yeah. Like, my favourite thing about Destiny was when you finished a thing and you finish your... You've done a whole bunch of missions back to back, back to back, back to back, back to back. You haven't really looked in too much detail of what you've unlocked because some of it is engrams. You need to go and decode mm-hmm. it and you have all these other things yeah. and whatnot. And you know that I need to go and talk to this person at the tower because now I, I'll give him these things and he'll give me this much and I'll unlock this. And I'll go, if I talk to that person, that person, that person... I'd love when you've finished a rain... You've done like a couple of strikes and a whole bunch of other things and then you go back to the tower and you spend... 15 minutes there going and talking to everyone and you get all this stuff and it's like right so now shit. go through it and so, and you come up you get some things like oh what's this I've got oh I've got this this is cool or you know you might go oh this is shit don't need this don't need this don't need this but other people are getting those things going oh I got this it, it just makes it so much more compelling it gives you a reason to want to go back and do these things the loot system is one of the biggest issues with this game like you don't get like a lot of the stuff I got was <laughs> Common stuff. Yeah, I'm just like this is useless to me now. At minimum, I need greens, but and there's I'm not already much on of it. blues. And there's yeah, there's not that much of it. And you can't change your guns on the fly, which is mad. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Um, you should be able to switch b- your guns out between the world. I understand. It's like oh, this is where all your stuff is. It's like it's a game. Yeah, I'm fine if you don't want me to be able to change my abilities and stuff like that on the fly with out in the world. You can't change what your javelin is. Fine, but your guns. Well, just Destiny works is there's so much on you you can carry. Uh-huh, uh-huh. So I thought you were just trying to make stuff. No, sorry. Throw up, then. <laughs> no, no, no. Yeah. Yeah, just pick up. A... Oh, yeah. There's only so much on you and you can carry, and then the rest goes into the vault. Yeah. And there's a vault here, but it's just like, why is there a vault? There's, you, can, you can only store all this stuff at yeah. the fort, and then you have a vault. Why? Mm-hmm. Is that a thing? That's fucking madness. There's, I think, this game causes so much anger among the genuine community, not the ones that are just hyping on the hate train, jumping on the hate train and what have you, but the genuine community who want to do, who want this game to be good. I think there's such anger and just frustration more than rage, because there's so much here where you go, this is so good. Why have you done this? Mm. Why has this decision been made? Jack says stream the Modern Warfare campaign. <laughs> Maybe one day. Maybe one day, but it's 20 past 10. And then you just... And together the package is just... What? There's so much in here. And it... 
could be amazing. It could be the best one we have. But at the moment, you're not even close to knocking Destiny 2 off of that mantle. Because Bungie have worked so hard, and Destiny's not my... These sorts of things are not a game I commit to fully. No, not me usually either. I got well into Destiny 2. I get really into them at first, but then obviously I just fall off because there just aren't that many games that I want to spend that much time with. And the problem it comes again, we're so saturated with other games. Yeah, no, but I, I, with games, I like an end. Mm. I like a point where I stop. I mean, multiplayer games... Less, I mean, the one I probably put the most hours in in terms of games as service is Overwatch. Okay. Very different style than probably Siege, but again, that's more towards the Overwatch model. It's a multiplayer, like a literal competitive PvP PvP game. Yeah, it's and I've put nearly three hundred hours into Overwatch. And that's many. Probably, would, but not really compared to the people who are actually no. into Overwatch. Not properly into it. But Destiny, I got really into it. I played, we played, that's pretty much all we played for a while when it came out. It came out in that time where, it came, comes out in like September, doesn't it? Yeah. And then you have all of September essentially and then everything starts hitting the fucking fan in October and then you fall off. Honestly, Destiny 2, I loved it and we played so much. Uh, Jack, Dom, Chris, Andy, I only played work, vanilla Tom. Destiny 2 though, that's the thing. I only played vanilla Destiny 2, but we went... Trials of the Nine, man! Fucking sick! And the Crucible! All of that, we, went, we did the fucking raid between us all, which, by the way, we did over, like, Jack, I think it was, like, three weeks before we actually completed that way, but non-stop. Like, we were, like... We're playing... We're, right, we're, we're raiding tonight, yeah? Cool. What time? Everyone is making sure we are there at these appropriate times when we were raiding, and it was so well thought out and planned. And that was, that was probably my... I can say it's my best ever multiplayer mm. online experience. Mm. The teamwork that went into that. We would all shit, get pissed off at each other and shout abuse at each other as well. Like, I told you, you would stay there and you do your thing. Fuck's sake, Jack, stop shooting the dogs until we say shoot the dogs. Um, like, but when we did it, it probably was long, but when we did it, when we finally did it. So like, we had like, do you remember, did you do the raid, the Destiny 2 raid? The Leviathan raid? Oh, bits of it. So like, We'd got to the point where we the dogs were the things we hated the most. We've, the the pools we figured out how to do the that. The dogs, what the fuck? The dogs were prick. The pools we had figured out. We were in team. We went when we went back every week because it resets every week. We we're like, right, we know exactly how we're doing this room, who was going where, how it was going to work, how we were communicating. To the point that the week that we did it, or like we, we did it in two days, in two nights, in the week we did it, we went in, smashed the pool straight away, done, first time, got the gauntlet. We had to go around the outside of the room. And again, we just knew what we were doing. We just smashed it first time. The dogs then fucked us again for a while. But we eventually, we sussed it and we found, got it, dogs, through. Got, when we then finally got into actually doing Callus's room. It took us like two nights to do that one. But when we finally did it, we finally fucking did it. Such a good feeling of euphoria of like, we have done this together as well. Like this has been an actual multiplayer game. I'm going to bug this down back to um, just a, an EA thing. Because mm-hmm. I'm going to compare Anthem to Battlefield Five now. Mm-hmm. Where there's content, they've just gone, it is coming. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And it is part of it. But it's not yet. And you just, So the cataclysms are basically, the, the cataclysms are basically, from what I can tell, the raids. Like, why isn't there one in the fucking game? And that, that's what I mean, like, from what I was trying to say earlier, like, how have they not figured out how to put this content in? Why isn't it in there already? Like, it's insane. Honestly, I think the one personal thought, just on basically everything Ubisoft are saying, I think the one that's going to be not necessarily void of technical issues, but the one content-wise that is there off the gate that smashed it straight away is The Division Mm -hmm. 2. Mm -hmm. I think is going to be one that gets that right because they're talking about the end game and the multiple different dark zones for different types of players. The I don't know who that is. <laughs> the multiple different dark zones for different type of players and all the raids and the, all the different missions you can do for the end game and the forty hours of story you can do and all the different side things. That game is going to be fucking packed along with probably multiple years of free DLC. That I think the division is going to be the one that is that that sits the best with its fan base. I think a lot of people are going to be put off the division from the first one. But that's aside. But, I mean, 
I just yeah, I mean from the jump have the most con I understand Destiny Two now is chock full of raids and strikes and nightfalls and trials of the nine or whatever it is now and <laughs> crucible and all that sort of shit like Destiny two. They've, they've smashed it and Anthem have just come in. Like Anthem doesn't have the cataclysms in the same way Battlefield Five didn't have Rush or mm -hmm. the Battle Royale mode that it was talking about. Like, what? What are you doing? Include the fucking game in the package people pay for. But it's just so annoying because, yeah, as I said, the roots are there. The seeds are there. <laughs> What? <laughs> Three times I've got to say something because you paused and then you said something else. Sorry. It's Go. absolutely fine because I was going to wrap it up to carry on. <laughs> oh, no, I'm done. I'm done. Indeed. Indeed. This has been Rabbit Hole Media's Anthem live review discussion. Don't forget you can follow us on Twitter at Rabbit Hole underscore UK. You can subscribe to us, subscribe to us on YouTube where you can see us anytime you wish. You can follow us on Twitch at Rabbit Hole Media and you can subscribe and follow us on multiple different podcast services on and around the internet. Indeed. Jack, thank you for joining me this evening and providing your anthem and your views. Thank you God, to that those. Was just a two-hour shout, wasn't it? It was. Thank you for those in the stream who joined in. Jack, Hannah, Jack and Hannah. That was all we was here today. But thank you. Thank well, you we don't anyway. know in terms of viewers. We don't. But there's you're the only ones that are active in the comments. Yes, but thank indeed. you. Thank you for taking part. I don't remember what shortcut button does the thing. <laughs> <laughs> Use the mouse. So can you click on the stream end one? See you later, guys. Bye.